guys and welcome to another vlog. So I'm currently in the, the Shangri-La, yes, because I am bougie now. Um, so we got invited along to come and stay at the Shangri-La. Um, I brought Leash with me. You might remember her from some of my previous vlogs. So we have just checked into our room and I have to just say, the view is absolutely unreal. But let me just give you a little tour. Wow. Can you oh. want cake here? Oh, okay. A champagne. Oh my God. And also you have a card. Right, so I'm just going on my lovely day shooting the room tour and there's a little little message from me that rhymes. We've got a little welcome card from the team at the Shangri-La, which is so lovely. And then they brought us a cake. And of course, we've got the champers on ice, guys. Woo! Lovely. Okay, so we have a king size bed for me and Leash to spoon in. We obviously have our champagne that has just arrived. And then we have a lovely bathroom. Mm, traditional selfie. That's what I love about this is like, look at that. Like it's got digital. I wonder if this is like a screen. <gasps> oh my gosh. Let's try and. Guys. Can you see it? I don't know if you can see this, but I've got ballet and sh on the shard on my screen. This is what you call the life of Lockjari. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so we've got this top drawer, which is full of amenities. So we've got like toothbrush, toothpaste, razor blade, cotton buds, shower cap, you know, all that jazz. Um, I don't know if you have, we've got a um, blow dryer in there. Oh. Looks like we've got a sign. Then we've got a scale. We have our bathtub, which we've prepped for our photo shoot. And then here is the view. Oh, and also, of course, we have, ooh, ooh, toilet. And we have a phone. We've also got just a basic B rainfall shower, but She'll get the job done. Nice. So I think this room is about a medium price room, which is probably between, I know that the cheapest room you can get here is around 450, 500. So I reckon this room is probably around the 700 mark. The most expensive room is a thousand pounds a night. So next time I come here, I'm gonna stay there guys. Okay, so me and Leash are currently setting up the bathtub to get some pics. So we've like filled it up with soap. Leash is meant to be doing something with the flowers, but she just dropped something in. I thought I didn't notice. <laughs> and then this is going to be the view of the picture. So it should be really cute. Let's show you what it looks like. Right, so it's six o'clock and we're supposed to be getting ready for dinner. Why are me and Leash in bed in our robes? Cozy. Honestly, this bed is huge. Well, I feel like she's like really far away. She's right, like she's next to me, but like far. Okay, so me and Leash are down at dinner We're at the restaurant Ting, which is the which floor is this? This is the 35th floor of the Shard. It's what I think it's the main restaurant for the Shangri-La because um, I think a lot of the guests eat here. So you actually order on a tablet now. So everything is so advanced these days, um, especially with COVID restrictions. So I'm showing you. So this is my outfit. My dress is from Zara. This is Alicia's outfit. Her dress is also from Zara. <laughs> um, let's order. I'm not sure what I want. Cheers. So for starters, we got, this is a wonton soup, and then this is tuna and salmon taco in a seaweed wrap. So definitely on brand for the diet. Mm, yeah. So well. Right, I'm gonna try the wonton. It's good. Your average dumpling. You know what I mean? <laughs> Living in luxury is the best. Ooh. So we have a Sri Lankan laksa, which looks 
so good. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Then we have Malaysian fried rice. Look at that. This really reminds me of being in Bali, like so much. And then we have cauliflower truffle. Oh, that looks so good. I can't wait to taste it. Excuse my fingers. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is unreal. Is it? Yeah. I never thought I'd think cauliflower truffle is unreal, but it's unreal. Right, so we have just got back from dinner. First of all, can I just say, chef's kiss at the Shard dinner, because I honestly did not think it was gonna live up to the hype, but I did. Anyway, we just got back to our room, and the view at night, so nice. How absolutely insane. We've got literally like half bottle of champagne left. I'm not wasting this. What the fuck happened? <laughs> <laughs> Why do I? <laughs> I literally do the most stupid shit. <laughs> no, wait, wait, wait. Hear me out. Hear me out. I am intelligent as in i'm book smart but i lack common sense right so i am currently in bed leashed is comfy as we are comfy in bed that last bit of cake and then we've got a really early start tomorrow because we're gonna go to the pool and shoot some more stuff in the room so we'll show you all of that good stuff um i think it's night time good night Good morning, guys. So it is the morning after the night before, as they say. Um, and as you can see, I'm still in my bed, but I've got my robe on because I'm waiting for Leash to finish getting ready. So we're about to go down to the pool. It's 7:30, so it's very early. But we wanted to go down and shoot some nice pics before it like gets hella busy. And then we've got breakfast at half eight. So I'm excited. We ordered a lot of stuff. Uh, so breakfast has just arrived to the room and it looks absolutely unreal having this like beautiful London backdrop behind our breakfast. So I think we're gonna shoot some pictures. Breakfast will probably be cold by the time we eat it. Anyway, but we're gonna have some lovely breakfast. I'm super excited. We've definitely gone a bit like ham. We've got like, we thought everything was included in our stay. The bill was 150 pounds. So let's see what they charge us a week. But regardless, I feel like me and Leisha are like whatever at this point, like it's fucking worth it. So breakfast at the show. with turkey and chilies. Then we also have these waffle, I think this is, is this waffles? This is waffles, yeah. isn't it, to taste? Are they like deep oh, fried? No, not waffles, um, Sorry, French no, toast. that's French toast. Then we have poached eggs on um, an avocado. Leash has got pancakes over there, living her best life. And then we've also got a bellini, you got a bellini, didn't you? Yeah. And what did I get? No, I got a mimosa, you got a bellini. All right, so Leash got a mimosa, I got a bellini. We've got some fruit, we've got tea, we've got coffee, we've got whey too much food but let's see how because y'all know i love a taste test <laughs> i could be a food channel at this point it's good how good is it 10 out of 10 no <laughs> oh my god don't talk to me for the next half hour oh my god it's <laughs> delicious leisha's eyebrow um eyebrows eyes literally just roll back in her head by the way guys if you um notice that my eyebrows look a little bit crusty 
just like a disclaimer, I got a brow lamination and I've had a bad reaction to the tint. So I've got a little bit of like bumps in my eyebrows. So don't judge the brow, okay? Anyway, let's taste the Bellini because I got, I was feeling, I wasn't feeling hungover this morning, but I was feeling a bit like, whoa. Oh, this is nicer. Do you know why this is good? Because this is good quality champagne. It keeps stuff. Right, I'm about to try the French toast. Oh my God. Okay guys, so we have officially left the Shangri-La now. As you can tell, I am currently on a train. I'm heading to Nuki. If you want to know what happened there, check out the next vlog. But Overall, I am going to give my review of the Shard. So on the whole, I'm going to give the Shard a 10 for just overall, everything, like the whole experience being worth your money. 100% I give it um, a 10. For service, I'm going to give it a 10 because I just felt like the staff went above and beyond. Like there were so many, so many times when people already knew who I was before I had said anything. Um, and just like, they always just, they always just did their best. We got a late checkout. Like they just did so much for us. Um, comfortability I'm gonna say the bed was outstanding and the fact that you have those like roll down shutters in the room means that it's like you could, I could literally sleep all day um, in terms of locations obviously amazing central London right at London Bridge right next to the train um, what else is there food in as you can tell from the vlog it was impeccable um, what else only thing I would actually say that I felt there's only a few minute details that could be better. The, bed the bedroom doesn't have a smart TV, so you can't really like watch anything but basic TV. And it would be nice to be able to like have some smart TV and I like, watch Netflix or whatever. Um, there was no speaker, so you couldn't really play your own music. That was a bit of, mm. um, And the, the design is not the most modern, but I understand like why it looks the way it does. Like it's meant to be like a really a premium chain. Um, everything's supposed to be uniform and it, it is really nice and it looks really good shower was great so overall we're gonna give the charlotte 10 out of 10. um i hope you're liking these review videos of like different locations that we're going to i'm thinking i'm going to start a rating system it's so, like i always say the different things that i rate but anyway hope you enjoy this vlog and i'll see you in the next one